All right, so after trying and trying and trying and trying and trying, hello, for a while, um, and having failure after failure after failure after failure, and thinking that my device was bricked, I finally was able to install Cyanogen Mod uh, 9, which I should reboot for this, just for fun. I should probably lower the brightness on the uh, display so you can see it better. I'll do that when it reboots. Although it'd probably be better if I did, <laughs> if I didn't. But now it's rebooting because it's going to be very bright. Um, now the boot screen looks really cool, but I, I just I think it's it chugs a bit. But <laughs> once it boots up, I'm going to um, I'm going to. Uh, Lower the brightness a bit so you don't get so much of a glare. But oh my eyes! <laughs> yeah, that that kind of chugs a hair, but uh, yeah. So there it is. I'm gonna try to reduce the glare. So um, I'm gonna show you some stuff. Uh, the lock screen I have set up so you can either go to the camera which was not working before this is one of the reasons I I installed this was because I decided that it was a good idea to start install uninstalling system apps in a very um, a very um, what's the word you know what's the word when you just don't give a shit <laughs> when you're just like ah, I'll just fucking I'll uninstall that I'll uninstall that it'll be fine it doesn't matter oh shit you know that uh, I just, so I just get it got error messages camera didn't work anymore so I was trying to install a new ROM to get all that stuff working again and this one I actually like not so much for looks because if it was looks I would have kept what I had but this I like a lot more because of um, a lot of stuff that it has to offer and the fact that my camera now works and all that fun stuff and every all the games actually function properly now. They're they're they were a little choppy, but now they play really smooth with no need for hacks to get them to run right. So I can go to the Play Store. Hey, hey, I g stop that! It's being stupid. Stop being stupid. Let's see. I can go to the Play Store. I can go to you know straight to Chrome. I can go straight to the camera. I can go straight to the file browser, or I can go straight to settings. For this, I'm just going to unlock, and I'm going to change the brightness so that it's not so glare, uh, so glary or something. <laughs> I don't think that's a word. Anyways, we're going to lower the... Wow, the brightness is actually fairly low, but we're just going to lower it more so that it's... I think someone died. I don't know. Whatever. They'll take care of it. Anyways... Um, I wonder if they hit the building. Sounded like it. I felt a thump. Oh well. As long as I'm okay. I don't <laughs> Um, no, but, um... So anyways, we'll get around that and, um... Go here. What are we, what are we doing? Um, so I have my widgets on here, which I couldn't really do well before. And, uh, because they would make everything chug. So, I got this... Set to cube in, I think, or cube out. I forgot, but it's the transition. So that that's, you know, that's a little thing. Um, you know, this actually, the touch whiz with the um, ice cream sandwich thing was a lot more convenient, but all the bloatware in the background was making it really slow. So, you know, that, you know, kind of sucked. And uh, I show off the camera, but I got this thing on a... Um, on a stand and uh, it would be black so that wouldn't really show much but it works now and that's a good thing so then I got my games I got a lot more space for games now so I can install some more games all that they shit bloatware onto this thing and it's annoying as hell they just like over four gigs of bloatware on it and they advertise eight gigs on this motherfucker it's so annoying when you get 
you know, you buy eight gig an eight gig device, and there's only like four gigs of shit on there, and, and or four gigs of space on there for you to install apps. And you're like, what the fuck, man? Where's my where's my eight gigs? Oh, I'm sorry, we we had decided to throw something on there so that you couldn't freaking have it, even though you paid for it. So yeah, now I now I actually have that. Um, what was I gonna talk? Oh, one thing I really like about this. No snapshot button. I know some people like that, that snapshot thing. They like to make it easy, but really, I hated that snapshot button. I have no use for it, and I would always accidentally press it, and that would take a snapshot, and then it would bring up a photo editing software, so I had to wait for the photo editing software to come up to cancel out, and then it would delete the, the file. It was a pain in the ass, so that sucked. And, uh, yeah, so that's that. Um... So, you know, I like the extra settings. I don't have to, I don't need an extra app to overclock or anything like that. And all that fun stuff. I don't have any, uh, okay. And yeah, so I got, uh, what is it, uh, Bluetooth, uh, you know, all the normal stuff. And then there's some extra options in here for launcher stuff. Uh, yeah, so, you know, I mean, there's, there's some interesting stuff in here. I do think the, um, the stock uh, ROM was more convenient in the way you could just pull little widgets up that would, you know, float above everything. And, you know, it, it was just set up really convenient, but I'd rather have this. It's a lot faster. Um, there's more options and there's, you know, less bloatware, you know. It's not filled to the brim with stuff and you can't use the space that you purchased. That is freaking annoying. And yeah, so, you know, that's cool. And uh, other than that, what, what else is there? There's, I don't think of anything so exciting I have to tell you about it. Um, hey, before I actually installed this, I actually installed a uh, earlier build by accident. I, I got the wrong link, I guess, and uh, installed a uh, previous build that was really previous and uh, didn't function very well, but it was still better than what I had. But, uh, yeah, I like this a lot better. Um, what else is in this? Uh, there's a... No, I can't. That was a different launcher I'm thinking of. <laughs> But uh, I'm trying to think what else is here. I'll show you some gameplay. Um, it is actually a lot smoother. Here's some uh, Spider-Man. Um, this game doesn't run as nicely looking as it does on certain like Tegra devices and uh, the iPad and stuff. So they really watered down the graphics for this. But it is definitely running a lot smoother than it was. And I don't have to use a friggin... You know, I don't have to use like three chain fire or anything like that to uh, get it to run properly. If only it would actually start. Okay. Wonderful. Spider Man. Spider Man's the best. He's hot. I want him. Come on, Spider Man. You goofy motherfucker. Of course, if I say that to his face, he kicked my ass, but whatever. There we go. But yeah, I mean, this game runs a lot smoother. It was really, it was kind of chugging a bit. I mean, like, the frame rate was really low, and it was, now it's fairly smooth. Uh, a lot smoother than even when I was using 3D Chain Fire, so. This is actually a really fun app. The only thing I, one of the biggest problems I have with it is the camera is a little kind of weird. You'll be uh, walking, and then the camera will just move for absolutely no reason whatsoever. But, um, you know, this is a lot smoother. You don't have all that bloatware running in the background. Um, apparently, from what I'm seeing in the camera, it looks a little too bright still, but yeah, I can't do anything about it. I quit. <laughs> but, yeah, it's um, it's probably the... the there's probably settings in the camera. What's it gonna call it? The EV con AV com blah, compensation. God damn it! But yeah, this is uh, this runs a lot smoother. Every game has. I don't even need 3D chain fire anymore. So, like how you, you drop from from that far up and you just land on your feet. Oh, I'm fine. You know, 
but yeah, it, it definitely is not, it was kind of uncomfortable to play before. This is the only game loft game that actually plays on my dog. See that? I'm going to show you if I can get the camera to do that again if you didn't. See that weird shit that it was doing? It was jumping. That's one of the big complaints about this game, but it's still really fun, so. See, it jumps like that. It's like, burp, burp. it's fucking annoying, but whatever. Anyway, so that's that's one game. I don't have much time.